second thought, let us not deal with Decker. Tis a silly man. Go this way. <laughs> I'm hoping this brings me to where I want to go, which is Old Town. I think. Maybe? Nope, this is a water merchant. Boogie, boogie, boogie. Slappy. Ooh, pretty, pretty stuff. Why is the moon? What do you do around here? I do. Do I? I do. Then I do. Then we all do. No, really, what do you do? I do this. Then I do that. You see Harold? Harold's fun. His hair falls out. Falls in the wind. There it goes. Wind. Wind. Whatever. Play global. <laughs> oh God, that's that's a war games reference. Want to play a game? Old '80s movie with Matthew Roderick about him playing a game with a computer, pretty much. Harold. Spare change, old friend, old pal. Can you help a poor mutant down on his luck? <coughs> oh God. Oh, God, you smell. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't have any money on me. Oh, my God. Oh, well, thanks, anyways. No, no, I still need to talk to you, I think. Oh, hey, it's you again. Hi. Anything I can do for you? What's your story? The whole thing? Well, well, after the Great War, my vault was one of the first to open. <sighs> Long time. Wow, you've been around that long? Tell me more about those days. I started with the sirens. I was young, but oh, I do remember that. A lot of terrible years followed. Then I remember walking out of the vault late one morning. What'd you do then? Well, uh, I was a trader. Did pretty good making a circuit between survivors. Lost a lot of good people, though. <laughs> oh, oh god, oh god, please, not in the face. Um, how? Uh, gangers got them. Scavengers attacking the caravans and mutant son of a dog if they weren't springing up like rabbits with a mission. <laughs> uh, Had to have an army of guards with just to do a deal. Where were the mutants coming from? Everywhere. Hell, seemed like you couldn't fart without hitting one. But mostly in the northwest. Did you explore that area? We mounted an expedition. God... Richard. Richard Gray. Let a small group of us up there. Richard Gray? Richard Gray was a doctor. A little older than me, and Fran was he smart. He found the source. And what was that? Some sort of old military base. We lost a lot of folks getting in there. How did you know this base... Or How did you know this base was the cause? Because it was like someone went bargain shopping at Mutant Land. Whew, cheaper by the dozens. Can't figure any other reason except that being the factory. Did you examine the base closely? We got pretty far inside. Wasn't a lot of us left by then. Gray, me, and a couple of others. And then? One of them robots got Francine. Mark was wounded. Sent him back to the surface. Then, it was just... Me and Gray. Whatever happened to Mark? To this day, I don't know. He never made it back here, and... Well, I... Couldn't face the wasteland again, so I... I never looked. What about you and Gray? We made it to some sort of central core, like a plant of some sort. That's when it happened. What? A robot crane crashed into us. Last I saw Gray, he was flying through the air and into some sort of acid bath. I was in bad shape and, well, I passed out. How did you survive? Didn't. Got killed. <laughs> oh, God, Jesus I Christ. love that joke. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I can tell. Well, I have no idea. Woke up in the wasteland, barely hanging on. Got lucky and some traders I knew found me days later. Good thing, since I was already changing. They brought me here, and here I've been since. How did 
how did you mutate? All I know is it was something inside that base. Do you think it could have been the radiation? How the hell should I know? Gray would have known if anybody could. <sighs> anyway, that's how the deal went down. Thanks for the story. Well, thanks for letting me tell it. Um, Barter, I want to see if you actually have anything, Harold. No, you don't. So, you know, if, if you want, man, I, th I think you should head to the East Coast. There could be bright things in the future for you down there. Seedy looking person. Knock, knock. Avon calling. Go ahead, get him, boys. Let's hope that this encounter doesn't kill me. That would suck. Stop killing my dog. Good God. Watch out for that ricochet, sir. They're trying to kill my dog. Get him, dog meat. Oh, okay. Then I will just block the door. Hi. Bye. <laughs> Who's next? Stop killing my dog. Get him, dog meat. Come on. There, killed that one. Alright. Good co no, no, no! You asshole! You fucker. You motherfucker. You done pissed me right the fuck off. Yeah, you better run. Cause you just fucking killed my dog. Yeah. Yeah, you better use a stem pack. And you better start running. Because you aren't surviving much longer after this, sir. Shouldn't have killed my dog. Get him, Tycho. Yeah, you better run. And we end the combat. Whew. I need to go loot his body. Motherfucker killed my goddamn dog. <sighs> there you are. Fucker. Yeah. The door is locked. Is it now? I gained 25 experience for opening up the lock. Now let's open up the dough and rescue this prisoner. Whomever it may be. Some dude. A battered man. Thank you, stranger. I don't know how many weeks, perhaps months, those thugs have had me here. I'm very grateful for your help. I'm sure the Brotherhood of Steel is also. 
Well, I'm glad that I can help. Thanks again. If you stop by the Brotherhood, I'll, I'd appreciate it if you'd let the if you tell Thios. No, no. Thanks again. If you stop by the Brotherhood, I'd appreciate it if you could let Thaos know I'm okay. I'm sure he's worried. Bye, and take care. You know what? No, 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 I think that's about all I really need to do here in the hub at this moment. So, uh, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button under the screen. If you really like it and want to see more, subscribe and be on the lookout for more. Uh, I'm Pink Deadpool, and this has been Fallout 1. In the next episode, we will continue flailing around incoherently through the wastes. But until then, peace out, and rest in peace, dog meat.